गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद वेरिएशन इन क्रोमोजोम नंबर दिस इज अ पार्ट ऑफ जेनेटिक्स चैप्टर सो लेट सी वॉट इज वेरिएशन इन क्रोमोजोम नंबर वेरिएशन इन क्रोमोजोम नंबर यूजली ह्यूमन और ह्यूमन्स हैव टू एंड नंबर क्रोमोजोम्स एनी ऑर्गेनाइजम हैविंग टू सेट्स ऑफ क्रोमोजोम्स टू एंड नंबर ऑफ क्रोमोजोम्स आई दर फोर्टी सिक्स थर्टी एट फोर्टी फोर्टी टू दीज आर दू सेट्स ऑफ क्रोमोजोम वेरिएशन इन द नॉर्मल डिप्लॉइड सेल डिप्लॉइड मीन्स टू एन क्रोमोजोम नंबर इज टर्म डेज प्लॉयडी इट इज कॉल्ड प्लॉयडी द वेरिएशन इन क्रोमोजोम नंबर इज टर्म डेज प्लॉयडी यूजली ह्यूमन्स हैव फोर्टी सिक्स नंबर ऑफ क्रोमोजोम्स एनी वेरिएशन वेरिएशन आइदर इट मे बी फोर्टी फाइव और मे बी फोर्टी सेवन और सो ऑन एनी डिफरेंस इन दिस इज टर्म इज वेरिएशन इन क्रोमोजोम नंबर द नंबर ऑफ क्रोमोजोम इज वेरिएटेड द टाइप्स ऑफ वेरिएशन आर ए न्यूप्लॉयडी एंड यूप्लॉयडी देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ वेरिएशन इन क्रोमोजोम नंबर दैट इज ए न्यूप्लॉयडी एंड यूप्लॉयडी Let's see what is the detail in a nucleoidy and euploidy. Let's see what is a nucleoidy. A nucleoidy it involves in the addition or deletion. It involves in the addition or deletion of one or few chromosomes. The usual diploid two n two n number chromosomes are there. Either something some chromosomes are added or some are deleted from the 2n number of chromosomes it is called a nucleoidy the a nucleoidy arise due to the failure of separation of homologous chromosomes the particular pair during the meiosis a nucleoidy mostly occurs during the meiosis when the homologous homologous chromosome cannot be separated is known as also known as the disjunction non disjunction it produces two sets of chromosomes one type of is one type have more chromosomes and another type has less chromosome there are four types let's see what are the types of a nucleoidy the four types of a nucleoidy are monosomic nullisomic trisomic and tetrasomic Let's see what is monosomic. Monosomic, they arises in the loss of chromosome from a diploid set. Diploid set are usually two n. There is a loss means minus one. Two n minus one usually occurs n or n minus one. Monosomic is a a nucleoidy case. It arises when there is a loss in chromosome number. When there is a loss in chromosome number. nullisomic they arises due to the loss of particular pair a pair is deleted that is from the diploid set diploid set is 2n a pair is deleted 2n minus 2 they arise by the fusion of n minus 1 type n minus 1 fused with n minus 1 there arises 2n minus 2 let's see trisomic there arises due to the addition of extra chromosome one extra chromosome is added to the diploid set that is 2n plus 1 to the normal diploid set to the normal diploid set trisomic is 2n plus 1 tetrasomics they arises by the addition of an extra pair of chromosome in the normal diploid set extra pair that is normal diploid set is 2n an extra pair is added to it here in nullisomic it is deleted here it is added the particular chromosome has four representative doses that is 2n plus 2 here we have an example of monosomic is a turner syndrome in trisomic we have an example that is down syndrome Let's see what are 
euploidies. See the type 2 variation in the number of chromosome that is euploidy. Euploidy normally organisms possess two sets of chromosomes. But in euploidy, the, at the times there is an addition or loss of complete set. Complete set is lost or added during the euploidy. Let's see its types. Giving its type you can understand more easily. They have two types. One is haploidy and is polyploidy. Haploidy or is also known as monoploidy. Out of two sets, two and number of chromosome of the normal organism, then one, sort, one set is lost completely. The resulting offsprings have just only one set of chromosome. 2n is completely lost. What is left? 2 is left. The resulting is only found is n. What is polyploidy? Organisms having more than two normal sets. The normal set is 2n. Polyploidy having extra number of chromosomes. 2n plus n that is 3n. 3n is called as triploids. 2n plus 2 that is 4n. Tetraploids. Polyploids have more than normal set of chromosomes. Haploidy. The two set of chromosome is again lost in haploidy. Haploidy is also known as monoploidy. So from here we, know, we came to know that euploidy is of two type. One is haploidy, another one is polyploidy. In haploidy, complete set is lost. In polyploidy, more than two sets are added. Here is a small example. A nuploidy is an individual that has chromosome number that is not exactly the multiple of haploid number. Turner syndrome contains 45 number of chromosomes and Kilfentry syndrome contains 47 number of chromosomes. In polyploidy, an individual has chromosomes that is a multiple of haploid number. 23's multiple is 69. Polyploidy is generally found among the plants but rarely found among the animals. About one third of the grasses are polyploids. These changes can occur during the formation of reproductive cells, in the early fatal development or in the cell after birth. Thanks for watching the video. Please appreciate the video giving it a thumbs up and subscribe my channel Simply Biology. Next biology topic is gene mutation.